Good day, good day. How the hunk are ya? Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dan. Oh, and today we're gonna be talking about this little bugger right here. Yeah, it's gonna be the 1968 Dakar gift set number seven. Yeah, so let's take a look around the model here. First things first, get some light going on this subject. Now I've got a couple of models here and a surprise model there. This one here I happen to find uh, locally, $2, not bad, a little dirty, has the original wheels like it looks like there. Now these are the Corgi uh, concave wheels and this is the Land Rover 109 long wheelbase, WB, and uh, back in 1968 is when they did this model and like I say it's uh gift set number seven now it had quite a few uh, characters with it as you notice <clears throat> they're all excuse me they're all missing uh, stuff on the hood now it's not a tire like you may think it could be no it uh, this Dakar uh, gift number seven was after, uh, was modeled after or built, uh, after the MB, uh, the CBS drama TV series that only lasted four seasons, Dakar. Dakar. Uh, no, not Dakar. That's a rally. <laughs> Dakare. Dakare. That's the name of the show. Dakare. And uh, what, by the way, let's take a moment here. Does anybody know what Dakar, Dakari means? I'm going to let you stew on that, all right? So here's one model that I've got. Pretty nice details. Uh, painted silver. This is a Series 1. They got the eggs on the grill. This is in a green color with uh, tiger stripes on it. Pretty interesting, pretty interesting. Now this one I bought, uh, I think I got it in a set. Now interestingly enough, it does have uh, a decal that the other one was missing uh, up underneath the windshield there. And uh, Wamaro Subdistrict has something to do with the show. Now this one has got some crazy aftermarket uh, white wheels. They have, those are not stock at all. You can get those on eBay. But otherwise, it was a simple, pretty simple, basic uh, Land Rover 109 like this that came in the gift set. I think they, uh, they I don't think they had a uh, hitch to them. I'm not really sure because none of mine have hitches to them. But it could could be. All right. Uh, now this one here is the earliest model that I have and I can deduce that by the uh, the wheels, the hubs I mean, the, the hubs. And uh, I'm going to tag my uh, previous video uh, where I talk about the Corgi wheels and tires, alright? And uh, now these are uh, O-rings that I bought from my hardware store because this particular model came with no wheels at all and I wanted to put something on there so I have something to sit on. But the first models, the hubs were cast spokes like this and then later on they came and had the concave uh, spun hubs like this. So there you go, first, second, and third. Now, uh, like I say, this, these were um, made in a gift set, gift set number seven, as I said, and uh, this was uh, a gift set of Dakari, uh, of, and, and the Dakari was uh, a TV series, drama TV series, CBS, only lasted four uh, season from January 11th, 1966 to January uh, 15th, 1969. Now, I did not watch this show uh, because I wasn't around till April of 69, all right? <laughs> so it was a little bit before my time, but uh, anyway, a good show. They had a lot, a lot of uh, 
Land Rovers in it. And what it was, was a father-daughter vets in Africa. All right? And it was a story about them. And are you ready? Dakari, do you know what that means? Well, that's Swahili for doctor because they were veterinarians. There you go. And uh, anyway, so th these trucks, before I take this apart, so these trucks had a tiger that fit on the hood and uh, his uh, butt end would be here and he would be uh, pointed uh, back over laying on his side. Uh, you know, if you Google that uh, Dakari uh, Corgis, you'll find the figures. There's uh, another uh, a lion, I believe, and he's got glasses because he was cross-eyed. Uh, Judy, the uh, chimpanzee or monkey, and uh, I think the peoples, uh, the head, uh, the father and the daughter. I'm not really sure on that, but yeah. So there you go. So let's take a look. This is kind of a basic um, corgi casting. And um, we're going to take a lot of uh, look at a lot of these because I do have quite a few. I've been collecting these for over 25 years. And uh, so there's, uh, they, they have different uh, gift sets, numbers that they go by. Like this is gift, gift set number seven, like I said. Uh, gift set number 19, such and so forth, other different things. Uh, but they're basically the same casting, okay? Uh, they colored them, and then they gave them uh, different numbers like... Uh, Number 351, uh, uh, 438, which kind of is a common one, 438. Uh, so there you go. So uh, most basically, they did come with a tire on the hood. Uh, like I say, this one is not correct. Uh, we uh, This one I got as a set. I think I got three of them off of eBay, and they were all in um, half restored or whatever condition. And uh, I wanted some, uh, three of them for the price of one or something like that, so I got them. This one did not come with the glass or interior, so we'll have to do something there. And then two, um, as you see, uh, I know that this is a, a Doctari truck because the inside has still got the, uh, I don't know what color you call that, uh, minty green? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not really sure. It's a it's a shade of green, um, but anyway, they they put a tire on there. They got it. They've got a hub I, that looks like a um, um, you know a corgi hub. That's real stuff, but that's not supposed to be on there on this one. And they fixated it on there. And then the wheels on this one aren't right either. You can uh, I'm sure corgi has made other. Uh, things with these hubs and, and tires uh, and other toy companies so they've just kind of put this together as you see this um, these are not the uh, original axles and uh, they put that on there but you can kind of see how uh, the suspension works for these uh, little corgis uh, the interior would fit in the inside of uh, those three prongs and uh, they are uh, put together by uh, two, two rivet construction kind of thing. So these are not tapped out, drilled out or tapped out or anything like that. So uh, I'm excited, uh, you know, eventually on this channel we'll be doing some customizing. So this is going to be one of them that we're going to redo and, uh, you know, put wheels on it or something. And I'm not, I'm, I'm hoping to find something uh, other than uh, just some O-rings. <laughs> but uh, kind of clever, huh? Yeah, uh, I bought 12 of them for the price of one set off of eBay. And, uh, you know, it's not supposed to be trickery. I'm not trying to, you know, trick anybody in, like this, I think, <laughs> you know. They're just supposed to be nice and uh, have something on them so they can uh, sit and roll. They're not sitting on their axles, all right? So there you go, that's what we have. This is the, we're gonna look at this one because this is kind of the uh, most original, although this one has uh, 
the nice decals on it. We'll take a look at this one on the way out. But there it goes, Corgi gift set number seven, Doctari. There you go. How many of these do you have? What do you think? Do you got the figures? You can buy the figures. I just haven't never bought the figures, but there you go. All right, we're gonna call it a video. Thanks for joining me today. We're gonna have more Corgis coming up. So stick around with the channel. Uh, let me know which ones you wanna see next, huh? Maybe put out in the comment below and uh, I'll do those next. Uh, I'm just going through my collection. All right, join me on Facebook, Roverland, Instagram, at Roverland Channel. And as always, Slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day.